This week on Please Explain Your Hairdo, we talk to influential artist and musician and filmmaker Andy Warhola, and we asked him, where is his hair going, and please explain, what does his hair mean? Well, I think my hair is uh, very interesting. It, it's um, something I've been working on for a little while now, and it, it, I try to make it sort of like a, a wave out in the ocean. A blonde wave, and I know that a lot of people like it, and they come up here and they and they touch my hair, and they seem to enjoy the the radiance of the, uh, the sort of albino sort of look, and I think that's very important in art and, and music and film. Uh, I always use my hair as as part of my filmmaking uh, strategy, and. And uh, it, it's part of the revolution that's happening now. You see all around you with all these interesting artists and and uh, and filmmakers that are coming through at the moment, especially in America and Europe. Uh, my hair is is symbolic of uh, of um, I think something uh, like a a washed taxi. It's it gleams in the in the sun and and um, you know it costs a lot. Uh, to maintain and and uh, and I think that's uh, very important in in, in modern day art in particular and it's um something I work on and and I wash probably about once a month. Do you think your hair is the main influence in your life, or is there other influences? Oh no, no, exactly. It's uh, it's the main influence in my life, most definitely. Um, I know that particularly a lot of uh, male friends seem to comment on it, and um, like I said before, they always try to touch it, and I've even had people come into my bedroom at night and try to cut off a, a, a few strands, and that's sort of been uh, in the creative process. It's, it's helped me to identify that perhaps my next artwork will encapsulate uh, a strand of my hair, put in a frame, and put on the wall because I think, why deprive the American public of of my my hair? I want to preserve it forever. Thank you, Andy Warhol.